What's up, world? It's Mona with another video. Looking a little bit rough around the edges and all that, but I just had a long day at work. Now let me start. It wasn't a long. It wasn't a long day at work. I actually had a nice, good day at work. But um, I just got out of work and I had to go to the store. I ran out of beverages in my fridge, so I had to go get some juice. And my daughter, she sound asleep. And she was having the biggest temper tantrum ever. Like, because I told her today was the last day of school, but then I called the school this morning and they told me that they changed it and that they will be extending school for another week. So she was just so upset. She was crying, she was screaming, she was stomping. She was like, no, I thought school was over. No, she's ready, she's ready to have, she's ready to wake up later. She's ready to sleep in. Like she doesn't, she's tired of waking up so early and having to go to school. She's ready for her summer vacation. And I just feel, I felt so bad because she was really upset and I was like, I felt bad, but I told her, you know, sometimes in life we have to do things we don't want to do, but we have to just get it done. And we have to handle our business and take care of it. So once I explained it to her like that, she kind of calmed down and um, she's taking a nap down. But I'm super excited for summer. I'm ready for summer. I've been eating a lot of fruits and stuff like that because you know in the summertime you don't really want to eat like bulky food so i've been eating a lot of fruits drinking water and you know just getting ready for summer like i'm i love the fact that in the summertime you get to wear nice pretty clothes and have your feet out do your little manicures and your pedicures and things of that nature but i'm even though majority of the summer I will be working, I'm happy that it's warming up. I got my air conditioner coming in the mail within a week because I'm not going to be frying in this apartment like I was last summer. So I'm definitely happy about that. Um, I got a few. I love clothes. So even though I know I don't have room for any more clothes, I ordered a couple summer outfits and... I'm ready for that. I also have a big surprise for my daughter in August. I didn't tell her. It's a secret. I can't wait. But I have a big surprise for her in August. And a secret surprise. And next week, I'm going to Toronto. I love Toronto. love Canada. love the vibes, the feels. I just feel alive when I'm in Canada. Love Toronto. Cannot wait to touch down there. I'm going to try to get to Drake Restaurant. Last year when I went to Caravana with some friends, we didn't get the opportunity to go to Drake's Restaurant. So I'm definitely trying to hit up Drake Restaurant. It looks so nice and classy and elegant. You know what I'm saying? Like I went in there. It was real nice. I went, I, we stepped in the restaurant. It was so funny because the day we stepped in the restaurant, we had just came back from Caravana, so we were all like, we had, we was all like, you know, makeup and extravagant clothes, extravaganza clothes, and, you know, extra. So, when we, as soon as we step in the restaurant, there's like people at the table and they just looking at us like, like, you know, like bougie, like, like what they doing in here? They, like, like we were interrupting their atmosphere type of thing, and it was so funny, so. The girls was like, uh oh, we in the wrong place. We we out of here. But it was so funny. But yeah, I'm super excited to be going to Canada. I'm actually going to a concert. I'm going to see the legendary Sanchez perform. I'm excited about that. And me and my cousin were going together. The same cousin I went to Caravan with last year. So this will be my second time in Toronto with the same person I went with the first time. So that's great. I'm super excited about that. 
And also, my daughter, she will be going to New York to spend time with her paternal family for about a month. And my best friend from high school will be coming up in a week. So I'm happy about that. I'm It's bittersweet. I'm happy and I'm sad because it's going to be like a lot going on. My life is pretty much low-key chill and consistent. It's going to be a lot of changes going on these upper couple of weeks. But I'm happy to be seeing my best friend. And I'm going to be... It's going to be bittersweet because I'm sad that my daughter's going to be going to New York for a month. But I know she wants to go. She really wants to go. And not only that, it's kind of boring up here. Like, we don't do the, a lot of things that we used to do when we were living in New York. And I know she wants to have fun and enjoy her f summer and see her family. So I have to be understanding to that as well. But I'm just ready to see what the summer has in the works. Even though I will be working majority of the summer, I'm going to try to put in that work. I got credit cards to pay off. I will be trying my hardest to work 12, like 12, 12 hour shifts. We'll be trying my hardest to work 12 hour shifts, but I'm excited. I'm definitely going to try to vlog my trips and things that I'm going to be going on and the stuff I'm going to be doing. And I'm going to try to you know, even if I'm not doing something, I can do like a video that I'm doing right now in the house talking about stuff. But I'm super excited. And I will see you guys probably next week. Maybe next week I'll do a vlog. And everybody have a nice weekend. And God bless everybody.